Hey guys, and today I want to teach you to make the YouTube one banner using paint and use some of the elements I did, like putting in images I got from other websites and also um, changing textiles and like what I did basically. So what you're going to do is you're going to click on the pencil icon, go to edit channel art, and then right down here it says how to create channel art. You want to click on that. And then I'll bring you up to what um, the resolution you need to have it at and what the safe area is. You're going to want to download this channel art specs right here. And I will come back to you. Actually, it's already done. So you can just, yeah. So when you get on here, you just right click and you open with paint. And so. First off, you'll see all this area that like, oh, I don't want to see a surfer guy in the background. Well, what you're going to need to do is grab the square icon right here. And then you're going to go no outline, fill with a solid color. And for some reason, the second color is the box. I have no idea. And then you're going to want to put the box around the safe area, the color you want. Just like that. And actually, you can um, put it out a little bit more if you wanted to get the extra lines. I didn't get completely. So this will give you an idea on where your safe area is. So you can put all of your important things in here. And don't worry about the rest of the stuff. The rest of the stuff will be removed um, later on. And I will show you how. It's very simple. It's kind of like what I did right here. So, I'm just going to make something really simple. I'm going to get a text box. I'm going to make the size 200 and then type, it's too big, you can just change it, 100. Alright, and then I'm just going to put Quay 12X, there we go. And then if you want to, um, for some reason the text box um, dis disappears after you click out of it. So we're going to need to do is the select tool and then you're just going to drag that into the center like that and then the next thing you want to do is if you want to have images you just type in google images like that and then you can just type in uh, mario basically and you're looking for a white background picture you can have like other backgrounds but keep in mind it will show that color up so if you want to have a black background, probably um, very carefully fill it in with black around it, the image or um, just find one with black background. So I'm going to pick just this one right here. And you're going to right click on the image and you're going to go down to open image and new tab. And then again, you're going to want to save image as go to a place where you can find it for me it's pictures down here and then type whatever you want mario pick or pick like that and then it should be something like this when I click on the um the image open with paint there we go so you're just going to want to select what you want to get just like that and then you're going to want to copy right there and then you just go over here and you paste it in. So you don't even need to make your window smaller. I thought you had to. And then there you go. And then for the rest of this, if you want to, you can just fill it in with the color you've been using. So I'm just going to get like that and grab the square and fill this entire thing in with squares. And now you can just save as again over here. Make sure it's in a place where you can find it. Type in banner, banner YouTube. Okay. Go over to your channel. Go to select the photo from your computer. Scroll down to the one that you just made. Alright, so I found it, and you just click on that, and then open, 
and then it'll upload straight to your um, YouTube channel and it should turn out just fine. And basically a safe area is something that all your mobile devices can see and it doesn't cut off the image in any way. So I'll be right back when that's done uploading. Alright guys, so I'm back. Sorry about the long wait. I, it has to do with me recording, but um, usually it's pretty instant. It's about 5 seconds to, um, to upload most of the time. So you just select the image, and you can see all the devices lined up before that screen to see how it's going to turn out. And there you go. So I hope this helped guys, and I'll see you later.